Got a box. So I'm going to box here. That I ordered recently. Actually got here pretty fast. I think it was like eight or nine days. Something like that. So pretty fast shipping overall. Crazy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, what a concept. <laughs> You just show them. <laughs> I'm not gonna show them right now. What's up, Walt? Because I wanna do this unboxing and then I need to prep review. Filming a uh, chest peak review uh, pretty soon here. What's up, Rogers? Yeah, I just wanted to. Fellow Young Buck. Yeah, that's right. Represent. <laughs> Most definitely. Right. Hacking slip. So I got the uh, beard. What's up, Mick? Beard trial set and body trial set uh, and the sandalwood fragrance. So I've tried the oil and the butter and the beard wash in uh, in uh, sandalwood from Everman Jack, but I saw this they were doing this for like seven bucks, so I got two of them. Um, I got the, the two packs for like twenty bucks total. What's up, Gabe? Um, oh, this is a nice box though. Clean up nice. It says right there. Got the package peanuts and the wood texture on the box. It's actually a nice box. I'm impressed. Give them another try, do another review. Do it, we'll do a review. What's up, Neil? Um, just because they're a big company and a lot of like new beardsmen, um, we'll, we'll probably see them in uh, stores. Like, that was the first company that I saw um, when I started, what's up, Scott and Beardo Beard Products. Um, when I first started like trying Canadian, like different, uh, like other beard companies, um, they're not Canadian, but when I started, uh, Trying other Canadian cup, other, I don't know why I just, literally has a box of root. <laughs> you know, it's, it's what is this? Oh, snap. Well, that's cool. I included a hat. I didn't know this was in there. You boom snap back. Let's go. <laughs> nice. They sell it at my grocery store. Yeah, it's in a lot of grocery stores. What's up, T3? Yo, so they included a hat in the box. That's cool. I was not expecting that. <laughs> That's a nice hat. I like this a lot, actually. Yeah, it's super dope hat. It's super comfy. I like it. I if you can't it's crazy they're Toronto. Yep, Toronto's wild. <laughs> I did not know this was gonna be in there. I'm, I'm hyped about that. This is awesome. <laughs> yeah, this is a really good looking hat. Yeah, super slick, that's what I'm saying. So this is the beard box sample, and you can get this as a uh, subscription. What's up, Wife Brewer? Dang, we got 14 people just like that. Let's go. Let's go. So you get this uh, information card, Tame the Beast. Shows all the products. Off to a great start. Shows the subscriber benefits to whom you unboxing. Everyman Jack, uh, Neil, that's why I'm unboxing. From Brampton. Not too far, probably like, like an hour from Toronto, so I don't know how far Brampton is in relation to uh, Toronto. Yeah, and you get this really nice presentation. I like this a lot. That's nice. And then you get Oh they've repackaged it since I uh since I tried it. So this is the sample size, so when you get the, the proper subscription, um they're gonna be bigger. So this is the two ounce beard and face wash. And you're gonna get a uh, sample size oil, 0.5 ounces. 30 minutes, yeah, something like that. Yeah, super nice. So it's a sample size, and you get lip balm with aloe and vitamin E. And then you get the beard butter with coconut oil and a two ounce container. Yeah. Alright, that's actually wrong. Yeah. Um, and the beard balm with tea tree oil. You should try this. Sorry, I haven't tried out their beard balm yet. Yeah, and then you get a uh, little wooden comb. These are always nice to have. I got a bunch of them lying around. But yeah, so that's the uh, that's the beard box. We got one more box to open up. Cool. So we get these are stuff here and there. Yeah, the house. Yeah, it looks really good. I'm really happy with this. It's, they didn't say that this was going to be in the box, like when you when you ordered. So, a pleasant surprise. And then, I got the 
body kit. It's like a mini Toronto's pack people, yeah. What's up, Slack Squatch? What's up, Beanie? What's up, Hostway? Yeah, really nice presentation on these boxes. Got the nice wood texture on them. Restrictor guy or drop guy? I'm a drop guy, but it seems every copy is going on restrictor. So, I used to did not like um, restrictors, but I've, since I've been using them more with like Chesapeake and Bearded Mac and those kind of companies, I'm liking them more, but dropper's the, dropper's the classic way. What's up, Liam? And there's what you get. Really killer presentation on this. I'm really impressed. Yeah, so there's that. Oh, what's that? You get this uh, information card. Try Scotch Porter, sold at Targets. They sell the best beer products, sold in stores. Scotch, yeah, I don't know if they sell Scotch Porter in uh, in Canada. I can have a look for sure. There's the body kit, products you can get. So you got body scrub, deodorant, body wash. Uh, Body wash and body bars. Yeah, how many kneecaps you taking this week? <laughs> What's up, face fair beard? Face for a beard, beard care. So then you got body wash, sandalwood scent. And you got the two-in-one shampoo and conditioner. And then you have face lotion, fragrance free. Really killer presentation on all this stuff. I like I like Evan Jacks, like whole theme. Oh, this is a little, uh, little deodorant. <laughs> Interested to try this out. Always on the hunt for uh, new deodorants. Yeah, another lip balm. It's pretty cool. You got the uh, body bar with uh, shea butter, and sandalwood. And Jack is a great starter company for people just getting into beer. Can I imagine a lot of people started there and then started finding. Yeah, that's how I. That's what happened with me. Um, beards and vinyl. Yeah, I uh, Everman Jack was one of was the yeah, the first oil that I used um, after being done with TBS. <laughs> Good enough for now. And it says hashtag clean up nice right there. Oh, what's up, G? What's in beard today, guys? Wrap. Whiskey and Hard Dog Ravager. Jolly Fat Man's in here. What's up, G Lou? Was he not? Yeah. <laughs> yes, yeah, so I'm rocking Rowing Ponies Mac Oil and then um, and then Flagler from Magic City. Um, the, what is it? Butter. Yeah. Let me know what everybody else is rocking. Yeah, and I had to pick up the uh, the two Star Wars scents <laughs> yesterday from uh, Chesapeake because those sound super fire. Light side peak, June sentiment, nice. Canadian A in the beard, nice. It's awesome. Yeah, I'm I'm intrigued to see uh, check out light. Uh, both both. What should I put in beard today? Oh man. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe. I don't know, that's, you got a lot of options, so <laughs> that's a good question. Yeah. Right now, some syrup. After I clean that out, I need to throw in timber trails. Nice. But you're looking exceedingly. <laughs> Just dropped off the post up. Nice. Yeah, I agree. I also saw that I got a uh, got my shipping notification for uh, Coaster Busy Day after that new release. <laughs> oh, yeah. Roaster oil and butter from Fable and Beard Today Living in Florida Bomb is pretty useless. Yeah, that's her. Magic, Magic Mike from Magic City is a solid dude. I haven't tried Flagler yet. I highly recommend Flagler. And that one I, I launched on my YouTube channel with uh, Swag. Um, light side and dark side mixed together perfectly. Yeah, it's they sound really nice. I'm definitely definitely excited about that. I'm going to be filming a review on uh, Chesapeake here uh, pretty soon. Bomb in Florida is pointless. Yeah, I've heard that from a few people who live in Florida. Um, but yeah, and I, I mostly prefer Flagler's awesome. Yeah, most definitely. Keep you busy this year. <laughs> yep. But yeah, that's what I got from uh, the Dark Side yesterday. Nice. Yeah, I'm hyped to get to get mine in. Like, woke up to a shipping notification already because G's just that fast. <laughs> yeah, so beard and body kits from Everyman Jack. This cool hat. I have to get a backup set if it's as good as I think it's going to be. Yeah, fair. Yeah, both of them sound killer. Your restaurant's in. Oh, nice. That's cool. Yeah. 
was also just worked on and started prepping my uh, game with lights and dark side. Yeah, most definitely. <laughs> yeah, it's, I couldn't decide and both sounded just absolutely killer. Someone in your window behind you, bro. <laughs> No, just, just the shoes. <laughs> Let's see how I have to get back. Yeah. It's, I'm excited to check it out. <laughs> yeah, Chesapeake's new, uh, new scent's gonna be uh, really, really excited. Talked to a couple people that have had it, uh, that already have it, and watched a bit of the stream yesterday, and definitely, uh, definitely sounds really awesome. Swallows in later. Oh, nice. That's cool. That's awesome. Looks like Nick. <laughs> yep, good old, good old beanie. <laughs> Don't feel like calling him. Neil, first warning. <laughs> your chrome, your chrome dome in the window. He's holding it. <laughs> getting, uh, getting raided by Vikings. <laughs> Who makes the light and dark? So I haven't heard of it before. So that's uh, Chesapeake Beard and Groomings. Um, send of the month. Um, for June. That they uh, just released um, yesterday on uh, Ken Bluegrass Bearded's channel. Because of, <laughs> yeah, most definitely. Can't miss my shiny head. <laughs> yeah, that would be funny though. <laughs> See Neil just like poking his head, just like up here. <laughs> just got you way back. <laughs> yep. Yeah, most definitely. Yeah, lots of. Uh, Beard show guys coming for you again. <laughs> Honestly, those guys, I, there's, I still have the, like some of them like watch my stories, <laughs> and like consistently like 200 people like see my posts. So I'm like, I see you guys lurking. Like you're not slick. Buddy, mine was on the show Vikings. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, definitely, yeah, definitely a cool show. But I was kind of, kind of finishing it ruined me. Like it was kind of ruined for me after uh, everything went down with TBS. <laughs> And it could be from your beanie on. <laughs> and then just like getting really close to the camera, like like Beanie sometimes does, just like like it it's, kills me when he does that. <laughs> and yeah, and then uh, I believe the Beard Regard is doing it, talking about some new stuff from uh, Weatherbeard. Makes a beard struggle best. Oh good lord. <laughs> What's up, metal guy? P boy. <laughs> but yeah, it's those guys. What went down? <laughs> With TBS, uh, it's it's a long story, but basically they went after a company that I'm close friends with the owner, um, Beard Tings, UK company, actually. Grab some of Beard Tings products while we're talking. <clears throat> yeah, so this is Beard Tings uh, Vanilla Killa. This is the, the flagship scent, and I'm an affiliate for them. Bearded Truth 15, I believe, for 50% uh, off. Um, support my channel. and. So yeah, TBS went after uh, went after Beard Tings and like left a bunch of fake reviews on his page, and uh, <laughs> and then I was just like not down for that because I'd known I'd known Andy, the owner of Beard Tings, since uh, since August. So what's up, Ollie? Yeah. So and then I just I was like, yeah, I'm not down with that. And then we kind of went on the uh, went on the defense and punched back at them with memes, <laughs> and then. I'm uh yeah then I was done done with them after that. And that was back in probably <laughs> Who is TBS? The Beard Struggle. That's uh they're a Canadian company out in uh out in Vancouver. It's a big bigger company, um like thirteen thousand ambassadors. They banned me from running too many of my own ads on their Facebook post. Don't drink the coin. Yeah, facts facts Ian. <laughs> Television network. <laughs> Giving out warnings now here too. <laughs> yeah, soon we're gonna have mods. <laughs> oh yeah, there's Beanie with the wrench. <laughs> oh man, that's funny. Yeah, TBS is not a good company. Subpar products. I have a review on them on my YouTube channel if you wanna check it out. It's by far my most viewed review. <laughs> so you know, it's it is what it is. It's but yeah, I'm Spare needs to believe he's been. <laughs> Gives the smell. Yeah. Where's Vato? Yeah, true. <laughs> yeah, this isn't YouTube. Vato doesn't doesn't live around here. <laughs> and I'm definitely a horrible business friend. Horrible products from it. 
Oh, make you try them? Yeah, it's 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 garbage. Even like Beard Axe products is fake too. Oh, Battle Axe? Battle Axe products? One one feather, is that what you're talking about? Let me know if that's what you're talking about, because Yeah, I did a review on Battle Axe and then I had a bunch of things going on with the owner. They're out just so cheesy. Yeah, I know. It's like... Send a couple oils from a friend. Oh, no. Sorry about that. <laughs> yeah, there. And then I found Everyman Jack after uh, after that. And then went down the rabbit hole. And now... Wait. I'm going to show you. They just changed the... Sense really nice that, that I had, but that's it. Yeah. But they didn't even last that long for me. Yeah, Battle Axe. <laughs> Yeah, Battle Axe isn't even a real company. It's a dropship company. Like, it's it's weird. Products do you think are top? Oh, well, let's take you guys off the tripod and go for a little walk here. So I already mentioned Beard Tings. Some boot nails had way too much tea today. <laughs> so yeah, Beard Tings is great. Really, really awesome oil and oils and balms. Um, and then Magic City. Also fire, really, really good sense. Ostrich oil, Mike is a super cool owner. Um, definitely recommend them. Uh, Bearded Coast, solid products as well. Uh, Copper Johns, really solid products as well. Definitely, uh, definitely good stuff. Detroit Grooming, really nice presentation, really cool branding, great owner too. Um, oh yeah, can't forget. Yeah, turn on this light here so you can see me a little better. Crown de Dirtha. Great products as well. Highly recommend them. Give me doing a review on Crown soon. Still working on that. They have, I'll show you. Oils, butters, and balms. And then Great Octane has a nice balm. And then can't forget about Chesapeake. Super, uh, super fire. This vitality is ridiculous. I'm not the biggest fan of this particular scent, but some people like it. So it might be, might be something you rock with. Beard Brothers, solid as well. Barn brand is cool. Tons of different, uh, different scents. Uh, yeah, Beardo Beard Care, he's in the chat. Um, yeah, my uh, my battle axe is sitting there in a the corner. I haven't used it in forever. <laughs> and then I've got more stuff in my bathroom that I'm not gonna go grab right now. But Chesapeake, Bearded Coast, Copper Johns, Spoken Holly. It's not in the pipeline. Oof. Not nah, sure thing. Um, what about Gibbs Beard Oil? Never tried them. Uh, I think I've heard the name, but. Never tried them. Yeah, one feather. I think you were uh, you were an affiliate or an ambassador or something for Battle Axe at one point, right? And I haven't tried whiskey and hardtack, but I've heard really good things about them as well. Um, oh, what else? Well, let me know. Yeah, if you guys in the chat have any recommendations for uh, that you've uh, that you that you wanna wanna shout out, um, let us know in the chat. Yes, I was. Oh. So I take it you're not anymore, based on love whiskey and hard tack. Yeah, that's. I've heard really good things, the whiskey and hard tack, and I'll try them eventually. <laughs> yeah, and this and also there's great UK companies too. Obviously, Beard Tings, um, Leftist Company. Oh, nice. Yeah, it's. <laughs> yeah, trying different products is is more fun, and Bloom Beards has some uh, some cool things coming. Weather Beards got some cool things coming. Magic City always has cool stuff on in the works. Um, Holly's awesome in her products are top notch. Yeah, yeah, I definitely, definitely am trying Bloom Beards after the uh, after the rebrand. I can I can promise that. I don't know when, but it's gonna happen. <laughs> Gibbs is a veteran-owned company. Oh, cool, that's awesome. Date in mind when you rebrand a little bit, we'll go live. Yeah, John, let us know if you have a date. I'm I'm definitely uh, just interested. Definitely going to be excited about that. Um, 
But yeah, never heard of Gibbs, but tons of great companies. Say so try me some Bloombeards. Yeah, same here. Yeah, but it's it's happening. <laughs> yeah, it's lots of cool things coming, but rebrand soon. <laughs> nice. Nice, there you go. Guys into beards, don't get Oh that's clever. <laughs> Smart. That's a good name actually, I like that. <laughs> yeah, that's cool. But yeah, check my Instagram, uh, pvoid. I've got tons of different, oh yeah, Bearded Mac is another one that I really enjoy. Put a date up soon, yeah, I'll be finalizing a few things that you guys will know for sure. Less than a month, ooh, let's go. That's awesome. That'll be, uh, that'll be a good time for sure. But yeah, definitely uh, picked up the cosmetology store. Oh, cool, okay, nice. Yeah, but there's there's tons of great companies out there and even even something something affordable like everyman jack is gonna be better like better than head over to grizzly beard yeah i've heard good things about grizzly beard oil as well definitely uh get to know look forward to it yeah that's gonna be i'm excited for that that'll be that'll be fun <laughs> uk company usa quality oh nice let's see what this bomb looks like from uh, everyman jack Definitely, definitely gonna have some hold to it. That's what it looks like. Yeah, yeah I've noticed with uh, Everyman Jack Sandalwood scent, the uh, Sandalwood is definitely subtle. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna try this bomb because I haven't tried this yet, but I'll be testing all this stuff for a while and doing a whole uh, whole review. Um, yeah, I'm super hyped about this hat. Like I wasn't expecting the hat to uh, be included <laughs> but lo and behold it was so shout out to everyman jack for that that's really really nice hat actually like nice quality got the mesh back classic u punk 65 percent polyester 35 percent cotton blue beard spoken broken my top three. Oh wow yeah, i think i've heard from a couple people that have like that have it so far that it's pretty uh pretty good stuff I'm gonna be uh, chatting with John here shortly. Um, chopping up, hanging out a little bit, maybe talking about some things for the uh, for the future. Who knows? But yeah, just wanted to get on here, unbox this stuff from Eggman Jack. There's their uh, website and social media. <laughs> yeah, really, really cool, pre cool presentation. Um, yeah, maybe just to uh, try these products out, give them a test, run them through the, uh, put them through the paces. Yeah, thanks everybody for uh, hanging out. I just dropped a new video today on uh, Barden. I'm, I unboxed their uh, tobacco, leather, and bourbon, um, tobacco, bourbon, leather, uh, oil, butter, balm, and beard wash bundle. Um, so that's on YouTube now. Go check that out. Link in bio. Um, Jordan, your life. <laughs> Appreciate that, Neil. Um, yeah, and then this Friday I'll be live with uh, Ken Bluegrass Bearded and uh, J Cruz Healthy Bearded. How many awesome and companies are out there? Yeah, there's there's a ton of great companies. It's and that's that's been one of my favorite things about like Dodge City Beard Oil. I heard is good. Okay, cool. Never heard of them, but yeah, One Feather. Feel free to message me if you need any any, uh, any other recommendations. Have any other questions about other uh, other companies to try? Yeah, I appreciate that, Neil. <laughs> and check out Neil as well. His, especially this year, his videos have really stepped up, like in quality, information. Like, I think he's, I think he's punching towards 400. So am I. We're move chugging along nicely, trying to put out better and better content for y'all. Um, yeah, check out my new video, Friday Night Truth, 7:30 p.m. this Friday with uh, 7.30 p.m. Eastern time, to be uh, more specific, um, with content creators Ken Bluegrass Bearded and Healthy Bearded J. Cruz. Um, <laughs> um, that's gonna be, it's gonna be a fun time. Bearded Regarders on Friday night. 419, geez Louise, that's awesome. Good stuff. I think I'm at 321, something like that. But slowly but surely, plugging away. <laughs> yeah, it's, I'd like to hit 400 by like July. So if you haven't subscribed already, I, I really would appreciate the sub. Um, 
putting out lots of content, unboxings, reviews on men's grooming uh, products with beard, hair stuff, all that kind of stuff. Um, yeah, this summer I've got tons of uh, tons of videos uh, coming. Also going to be posting music that I've made. Seven days a week to catch up. All the great content you guys are putting out. <laughs> yeah, facts. There's a lot of uh, a lot of content being put out. <laughs> And even with the live streams too, there's so many. Like, there's always something to watch. Yeah, it's always a good time. But yeah, it's kind of what's up, George? JD Rex. Yeah, that's kind of all I wanted to say. Um, if you guys have any more questions, let me know. Um, otherwise, I'm gonna bounce off and uh, keep working on my uh, chair speak review. Hit the button, John. Haha. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, lots of fun things coming soon. I, if you hadn't noticed, I'm in a new space. Um, got my desk set up over there. Rearrange my whole uh, my whole bedroom here so I can have my studio in here because I'm gonna be moving soon. I'm just gonna be gonna be crazy. So stay tuned for that. Um, I think I'm, I'm, I might do one more studio tour in this space um, to tie it over till I do uh, a new a new studio tour in my new space when I move. Um, yeah, it's gonna be uh, interesting, uh, interesting times. <laughs> yeah, thanks everybody for uh, tuning in.